You all know who I am and why I'm here. So let's get down to business. This Saturday, your first FMN Nation champion will defend his title for the first time in six months. And I'm facing off against even more competition than last time. Let's start at the bottom of the list. Mellow Yellow. You're nothing more than a parrot there to warm a seat and repeat everything that Ken has to say. What have you ever offered to any show that you've been a part of? Nothing but boredom and disdain. But enough about you, you fat loser. Let's talk about a bigger fat loser. Tommy NC 2010. You, with your fake title hanging on your wall. One that I still have to call MTV and Comedy Central to find out if it's even legal for you to share their logos on the same title. Something you created on your own. Not something you earned like me something you purchased bought with somebody else's ill-gotten money you may have won a certain title but you certainly aren't a champion and moving up the list of losers we've got Cunny Chris Man, that guy tries to be black so badly, he's almost like Joe Crow. But the sad part is that no matter how good your raps are, you're never gonna be black. And you're never gonna get this. So, go back to Harlem and let them know how black you are. One more step up the loser ladder is Filthy Mouth Kingdom, a guy that isn't very often on. And when he is, he likes to uh, cheaply leave. Yeah, you got a big words, you got the insults, you got the keto diet, but you ain't got nothing else apart from that. You got your video games, but will they uh, be buried with you? when you die now let's forget about that guy because that's a sad case let's talk about now an even sadder case gatekeeper drew the cheese man or as I like to call him mr. stinky you're nothing more than mellow on steroids you are a yes man to the ultimate degree. And certainly that is not worthy of being a champion. So stick to what you're good at. Hanging around fermented milk and leave us champions to our bitty. Now let's talk about the lovely Ms. Shannon. Now I have a lot of respect for this lady. She is very much dedicated not only to her family and husband, but even to the shows themselves. But, lady, let's get serious. First and foremost, I'd like to ensure that if you're in the running for this title right here, it means class. That means you better have a dress down by your ankles and covering your wrists that's right be traditional be a true champion at this point you haven't even appeared on camera and i'm sorry you could just be a voice box that ken created and your artificial intelligence unit until we see you there's a lot to question now last and certainly not least there's you Foul Mouth Ken. The same individual that I went toe to toe with when I won this title. 
Now, Ken, you have been called the people's champion. In fact, you have won a certain title from a certain competitor six times. But this title right here needs more than this people's champion. Someone that embodies what this title means. It needs a warrior. Someone who will face the world and show neither regret nor mercy. This Saturday night, Championship Weekend on the Foul Mouth Network. Remember, I am Devious Dave Rose. I am the 12 time World Sail Away Champion of the World, two time Hemi Award winner for Best Feud and Drama host, the first and longest undefeated and reigning FMN champion, and your first and only drama emperor. They also call me Mr. Consistent and the most intelligent man in the community. I am Devious Dave Rose, and I am your FMN Nation champion.